Hi guys, welcome down to Bramwell Park Golf Club. I'm joined by this man. How are you doing? Mr. Matt Fryer. We are on, this is part two, we're on the fourth hole of the front nine. And we're facing now with a 116 yard par three. If you've not seen part one, do go and check it out because a lot happens, doesn't it Matt? It does, I don't want to talk about it. I'm just getting over it in my memory now. Well, let me remind you. Please don't. <laughs> so, I'm, I'm up first. That'll give you an indication of who's leading. Yeah, look at the smile on this guy's face. I'll use my injury later if you start leaving. I know, yeah, there was a lot of excuses in part one, and then all of a sudden they didn't start coming out when you got up. Well, actually, it was... every, every, every shot so far has had a bit of a... Oh, on the way through. Don't like, believe him, guys. Oh. So, 116, down the hill, what are you going with? I've got a little gap wedge. A little gap wedge. I'm going to hold it to the right side of the flag, and it's going to spin straight back. down there. It's going to spin left. God, this is technical stuff. Or we'll just leave it out right. Well, I've missed the green right, guys, by quite some distance. That was uh, not your best. That was terrible. I feel that the tides may turn. <laughs> oh, man, I'm really injured. <laughs> really injured. <laughs> Really, really hurt me that shot. That was awful. I don't know what I was thinking. I don't think it was enough. I don't think I hit it hard enough they either. Look stuck there behind it, really. I think it's because I'm injured. Club behind and a little bit healy, was it? It was out the middle, but a bit thin. Ah, right. It was everything that was wrong with it. Right, I've got a pitching wedge. I'm just gonna. I'm trying to hit it a little more, knocked down and controlled. See what we can do. Roll her in close. Roll it in. Hole in one. Just over the side of the bunker. Yeah. Safe. Uber safe. Right then, so we're up on the green. Well, I'm up on the green. Oh, the Carter is down here in these Augusta like pine trees. Like a really awkward downhill lie. Downhill lie, if you can just see it there guys. Downhill lie, he's got to come over this bunker, over there, to the flag. So just gonna have to play a bit of a savvy shot here, aren't you? You seen it straight up in the air? Yeah. Yeah. Just caught the bunker face, unlucky, it was tough from there. Very tough. I wasn't aggressive enough. Yeah. Right, who call this? You would think, but given my putting display at the moment. That's the point. Okay, closer. But part two, all positive for Matt. Just a bit by. Nearly went in though. Nearly went in. It was so close to hitting the flag. Got about 10 foot pass. Oh wow, that was cool. Right, so I've still got my bag on my back because all Fry really needs to do is roll this stone dead. Gone a li it, little bit far. Pretty straight, you say? Yeah. Straight down the line here. Put a good stroke on it. Let's start part two off with a birdie. Go! Oh yeah! <laughs> and champagne golf. He is back. Part awesome. Two, always start with a birdie. Come on. Birdie, bogey, bogey, birdie. Level so par. Things called 
pars? No idea. Overrated. I'm gonna go and try and find one of them. Are you give me that for par? I'll give you that for par. <laughs> well done. Right, back to all square. Great birdie. Feels great. Feels well good, guys. I'm glad you didn't win Subscribe it with a par. Subscribe to me for that. <laughs> That was like a demand. Yeah. <laughs> demand you subscribe. <laughs> Please. Hole number five. Match all square and hanging in the balance. 341 yards. We have a greenkeeper to go over. It's difficult actually. I'm just trying to weigh that with myself. There's a couple of bunkers to thread this ball through. The, the ones on the right. We can clear, I presume. Yeah, hopefully I'll say it. But they're not in play. <laughs> right. The one in line with like the flag. Yeah. I think that's about 280. Which is there. Right, so right behind that buggy or greenkeeper thing. Tractor. Greenkeeper thing. <laughs> Can't get my words out. <laughs> Technical <then. laughs> The thing you jig that they cut the grass with. A mower. That's the one. So that is in play. So a little butter cut off the bunkers, I presume. Yeah. Perfect, that suits you. You can get past him. Race him. Race the greenkeeper. Just double crossed it a touch down the left. No danger, I don't think. Yeah, it's fine. It's down the left of those trees, but I don't think it's in any danger. No, it should be pretty open out there. A bit scared about hitting the thingy majigger mower man. <laughs> the thing. The thing. I probably need to wait. I don't know what he's doing. He's driven into distance, he? Yeah. He's got his blades up, so whether he's just going. Blades up. Blades up, guys. <laughs> Sounds like something out of Top Gun, that, doesn't it? Blades up. Or dodgeball, laser, blazer, and taser. Birdie's gone to my head, I've gone insane. Turn around. Come on, greenkeeper. Alright. Oh, I'm letting you go. Right, so I'm going to, when slightly down and off the left, so I'm going to aim between the greenkeeper and the bunker. Uh, stay connected. I'm going to draw it. Oh, that's right at the greenkeeper. Don't go with my ball. Please. You could have half a pro uh, Callaway Chrome soft there. <laughs> <laughs> Not bad, it'll be okay there. <laughs> right, we've got Friar's golf ball. He is with an interesting shot because there's the flag. Just there we are, just struggling to focus. Um, what are you doing? What are you gonna do? Wedge. Straight up and over. Can, straight up and over. Straight into the sun. Yeah, it's only going about 60 yards the flag, so this goes about 100 people out anyway, but we've got to get it open and get it up. The this is not too bad, which is good. Let me try and get a slightly better angle on this. This is not going to be easy. To it is the key. Yeah, you do need to open the face a little bit. Yeah, I've got it open. Oh, caught the tree. Caught the tree. Just popped it down there. Hard oh, luck. Difficult shot. Get it up quick enough. Nope. Not good. How far have you got? 68 to the flag. 68 to the flag. I'm out with the lob wedge again. Just there. Again, I'm coming over the shoulder of that bunker, so in my mind it just suits me to go a little bit higher. I don't think it's really in the way, but if I try and land it up, it's too hot on the flag. Ideally, it gets me good direction as well. Mm. Lovely shot. A little bit long. Back, yeah, just a bit long, but. Right, guys, so there's Fryer. This is what he's faced with. Flag towards the front edge of the green, about 10 feet on or so. Lob wedge, sandwich. 56. 56. Little pitch. Up and down needed because I'm in a meh decent position. I've got a straight downhill, I think. Stand it just on the green, it'll stop pretty quick, I think, this. 
Oh, they are releasing, aren't they? Yeah, there's a bit of sand on them though, isn't there? So we kind of you walk on them and they feel soft on the foot. Yeah, but they just don't. They don't half release up the green. Not bad. Played it how I wanted. Well, that's all you can ask for. Yeah. Right. So on the green, Andy's got 20 feet just up there. Comes down a little bit. Probably a bit right to left. I'm just there. It released a bit more than I thought. So. He cozes it down, he'll put the pressure on me. Let's see what you're made of. It's looking good, looking good. Oh, just pulled up on him. Well done. You've done enough there, take it away. Thank you. Oh, God. Pressure on me. Pressure is on you. I'm just steady away making pars. You're winning holes with birdies and losing holes with bogeys. <laughs> Another good inconsistency. <laughs> well, I think it'd be unfair to give myself a par on the last, but. Well, if it makes you feel any better, it's so much more enjoyable to watch someone keep making birdies and bogeys. Okay. Right now, people are bored of watching me make par. Okay. They're enjoy oh. they're, they're enjoying the uh, the secrecy of what's to come next with you. For the first par of the day, it's got to hit it. You can't leave it. <laughs> you left it like a foot short. <laughs> I thought it was going to, like, looking at the hole there, it runs downhill. Or, I thought it was going to shoot up like Right. Another bogey. Bogey for fright. You can't leave a putt for the half a foot short. Yeah. Well, let's, let's be fair, he's going he's to birdie the next. Yeah, birdie the next now. <laughs> Back to level par. <laughs> right, guys, I'm one up. Bring on six. Six hole, 574 yards, long par five, straight down the hill here. The I'll green the greens at the um, the house there, you can see in the distance the roof of that house. Carter's one up, I need to find some consistency. How's that body feeling, Carter, all right? Oh, Lots of lactic acid, if that's right. Is that right? Yeah, build up of... Beauty, straight down there. Nice shot. Felt like I'd spun out of that at first. I was quite happy to see it when I looked up, it was just a tiny little one yard fade. All this connectivity. Guess what's going to happen here, Carter? Birdie. Birdie. <laughs> Guess what's going to happen on the next? Bogey. Bogey. Jones in part three. <laughs> Right, little cut down the left. Little buttercup. This suit this suits the eye quite nicely for a fade, doesn't it? Yeah. Feeling this one. Oh beauty. Just in the centre of the club face. Down the left side. Nice shot. Good one. Right then. What are we going with? I've got a five iron, I think we've got miles to go, so. I'm going for placement. I'm just going to middle of my stance, five iron out the rough, aiming just left of that house's, that house's garage. Just left of the house's garage. If it runs down the hill, great. I don't really know this hole, so I'm going off what you've told me. Oh, that is a bullet. That'll be good, that. See? Yeah. <laughs> One, two, three, four, fifteen clubs. No. Sixteen. Just fifteen. <laughs> I've got like another three wood to try. But. <laughs> right, fires out with three wood here. I think it's about two fifty flag, so 
keep that birdie train going. Keep it going? Well, You're skipping from train to train? Yeah. <laughs> back to back, a little cut. You got the strike, I don't think it's cut though, has it? Just stayed on the two, three tall trees there, stayed on that line, flags a little bit more around to the right. Got the strike. Yeah. Be interesting to see where we finished. This birdie is going to be magical if I can get it from there. No problem to you. So guys, do you like my new house? <laughs> I'd wish. Imagine having that house at the back there. Yeah, average. Average. Sorry if you're watching the video. Yeah. <laughs> nice house if you are. <laughs> 95 to the flag, slightly downhill. Right. What have you got? It's got a little um, sandwich. Sandwich. To play this kind of solid nine o'clock swing. Solid nine o'clock swing. So left arm parallel to the ground. Mm. Ball's a little bit awkward, so wait forward. Looks good. A little bit long, sorry about the focus there guys. Terrible. We're struggling with wedges today aren't we? Shocking. Right, so fly you're a little bit further up than me. You hit yep. three wood, you've avoided the trees quite nicely. So well done on that. Downhill yep. towards the flag there in the distance. We're probably about what, 50 yards away? Yeah, 50. What are you are with, sandwich? Yeah, I got 56, just got to get a little bit more, go with the slope. If you're ever playing on slopes, guys, try and match your body, like, like your shoulder line, to the angle of the slope. So with it being downhill, going towards the target, I'm just trying to get level there, so a bit more weight in the front foot. Similar shot now, like to yours, parallel to the ground with left arm, and try and get this birdie train started again. <laughs> it's been a while. It was. Good effort. Nice shot. I thought that was going to be like that stitched. Oh, releasing so much, it, that first bounce is quite firm, isn't it? You're out the rough, probably. I was on the fairway for one. <laughs> right then. We've got cart dog. You're right over there, mate. There's not a lot in it. Me just there, just ran on a little bit. It's just skirted the hole so can't see in this Not pretty straight, straight down the spine of the green. about 45 foot I'm going to hold mine so he needs to get this in Ooh, great pace just moved the other way I'll give you that one. Expect from 40 foot. Yeah. Oh, well. Right, Fryer. We all want you to finish on a birdie. I just told him I was going to do it. Oh, right, okay. Then he's got to do it. Oh. Seriously, we're trying to play some golf, yeah? So big time. I I did I did call Manchester Airport and tell them we were playing and asked them to reroute the, the flight path but right to left yeah. come on get back to all square make a birdie oh I think you hit it too firm pace beat it take that away it's my first part. It's your first part of the day. <laughs> Guys, thanks very much for watching. Big thanks to Matt Fryer as well for coming on. So please do subscribe to the channel. Yep. He has entertained you with birdies and bogeys. Lots I... more on my channel as well. <laughs> more birdies though. More cars. birdies. Yeah, we don't you don't you don't usually make bogeys. Yeah. Massive thank you to Bramwell Park Golf Club as well. Absolutely gorgeous place. Great golf course and we'll be see you over in part three very shortly so guys stay tuned carter one up through six